Aloha! Hawaii is a dream destination and for most people it is once in a lifetime opportunity. So we understand how important it is for you to choose the right hotel to stay. That is why we created Hotel Walkthrough Series where every Wednesday we are taking you on a complete walking tour through different hotels on Oahu. If this is your first time to our hotel walkthrough series, welcome. If you've seen our hotel reviews before, welcome back. In this episode, we're taking you on a complete walking tour of Out Sugar Waikiki Hotel. Just be out with us. Our Trigger Waikiki has just one tower. Just keep in mind that if you choose Diamond Head side rooms, uh, uh, Moana Surf Rider Hotel Tower is right next to it. So you might have just a view of another hotel. There is also a perfect ocean view on the beach side and on the other side facing towards Ala Moana, you get some partial ocean view and street view. Uh, Outrigger Waikiki is centrally located. It's right across of Aloha <laughs> International Marketplace. And there are actually two Outrigger hotels in Waikiki. One is Outrigger Waikiki, the one that we're doing the complete walkthrough today. And there is also uh, Outrigger Reef Hotel. And it's just uh, gotten completely renovated this year. So this is the f all these uh, front stores uh, a part of uh, our trigger Waikiki and this is where you would enter uh, and uh, see the valet parking. Valet parking is $40 per day. So as you enter, I'm going to put my mask on. There is a sunrise shack, a coffee shop, and acai bowls. Uh, they're actually really popular because they have a couple of locations in, on the North Shore. And you will see escalators going up to the second floor uh, for the registration. Uh, here's another entrance for the Quicksilver shop that you saw the entrance on the street front of Kalakawa Avenue. You will see a bell desk service. Ray-Bans shop and of course ABC shop where you will find all your necessities. There is a Malibu t-shirt shop where you can find some vintage t-shirts. And here you will find the Pearl Factory. This is uh, actually a really cool place. You can pick your own pearl from an oyster. There is another shop with all your beach necessities, some bathing suits, hats. And the reason why our Trigger Waikiki Hotel is so popular is because Duke's restaurant is located here and uh, they have a shop here for Duke's restaurant but to get to the actual restaurant you have to make reservations few months in advance there are some uh, there is another uh, pearl shop and the uh, elevators to your rooms so you have to make reservations either few months in advance or sometimes wait in line for two hours if you're lucky you get in and right upstairs there is actually our favorite restaurant Hula Grill they serve breakfast brunch and dinner there is a, a cute art gallery and a shop ATMs another jewelry and souvenir shop and here at the corner they have a small uh, deli Pies deli where you can find some breakfast items, smoothies, they are only open uh, for breakfast and lunch. And in this area, you will find some shaded seating for you to have your lunch or breakfast. And there are um, 
washing machines here so if you're staying or maybe if, even if you're not staying here you can still come in and wash your clothes here and the pool and the beach entrance is right here so let's check it out if you if this is your first time to our channel my name is Irina and Devon is operating the camera and we are just be out we create informative travel videos to help you get the most out of your vacation so the pool area is really small uh -huh. have just a few loungers and from this side you will see the front lanai of uh, the Duke's restaurant and right above it there is Hula Grill as well. Uh, from after about 2 p.m. Uh, the sun goes to the opposite side and this entire area uh, goes in shade so you get a lot of shade here and here right now they're just loungers but for during evening time they put tables on this entire deck area right now there is a musician setting up and the Duke's restaurant is famous for playing live music uh, and on Sundays, uh, pre-COVID, they used to clear this, this entire area and people would be dancing here. So, and uh, a lot of people just also uh, hang around this area from the beach side and you see people just listening to the music from the beach side and dancing on the beach as well. All right, so let's go to the beach. Right next to our trigger Waikiki, there is Royal Hawaiian Hotel, and we have done a complete walk through Royal Hawaiian Hotel as well. We will leave the link to the entire playlist of our hotel walkthrough in the description or uh, at the end of this video. And this is it. This is the Royal Hawaiian Beach. This is a part of Waikiki Beach. You can rent chairs and umbrellas here for. Uh, it's not included in hotel for a separate price. In this section of the ear, uh, of the beach, you will also find three catamarans. Let me just stand in the shade. Uh, and uh, they offer uh, uh, rides for a different price. We will also do a complete walk through Waikiki Beach from, uh, from the beginning to end. And we will show you where uh, everything is located. So be sure to subscribe to our channel. And most importantly, click the bell notification so you know when our video comes out. So uh, this uh, uh, hotel has another entrance from the beach and we will show to you shortly this out trigger is here just for show it normally doesn't go out but uh, there are out trigger rides you can find and it is so hot The sand is so hot. This is another entrance to the hotel and this is another viewpoint of Duke's um, restaurant Lanai area. And on the top, above, you will see uh, um, Hula Grill and those are the ocean front rooms. From this side, you will also see uh, the deck area of Duke's restaurant. It is always packed, guys. And here, uh, there's a side window you can pick up drinks or maybe to go orders from here as well.
We've been living in Hawaii for over two years and we have created over 200 videos for everything Hawaii. We want you to have the best vacation possible. So we try to cover everything you need to know about all different islands. So if you have any questions or if you would like us to create a video on any specific topic that you're interested in, let us know in the comments. And if you have stayed in uh, our Trigger Waikiki Hotel also let us know. So we're back to the main lobby where we came from, from the, uh, from the street. And now we will show you uh, another entrance or exit of this hotel. And then we'll go to upstairs to the registration area. So this is um, a hallway where you will find more shops. There's a, another a jewelry and souvenir shop. More souvenirs. This is um, a wedding shop. If you guys planning to do a wedding hair salon. And right across the street, you can see the International Marketplace. It is a really uh, popular outdoor and gorgeous outdoor shopping mall with the banyan trees and little ponds and fountains. It is beautiful. We will do a complete walkthrough, so be sure to subscribe and uh, click the bell notification. So now we are going to, on the street view, uh, street side. This is Kalakawa Avenue. And we're back to the main entrance from the valley. Now we're going to take escalators to go upstairs. The resort fee of this hotel is about $40 per night and the rooms start at about $300 per night. Here we go. There is a spacious lobby. Uh, there is a concierge services here, and uh, Blue Note is located here at this hotel. And there is the shop for Blue Note specifically. We will show you the entrance to the Blue Note itself. Here's the registration area. I love this area with the gorgeous Polynesian canoe. There's more uh, elevators to go to the floors, to the top floors, and entrance to the Blue Note here. They do a lot of events. We've been to Blue Note a few times.
Blue Note is usually open in the evening. I feel like our trigger Waikiki Hotel doesn't really have cozy lobbies so to me it feels a little bit empty and here is the entrance to Hula Grill again this is uh, one of our favorite restaurants if you choose Lanai seating they have really great views and the food is delicious and this is the staircase that leads to Duke so let's go down this way members for voting for us to do this hotel walkthrough if you enjoy this tour be sure to check out the other hotel walkthroughs we will leave the playlist right here mahalo so much for watching don't forget to click like and leave a comment below if you want to see more hotel tours like this mahalo so much for watching and as usual we'll see you next wednesday